trip to the historic battlefield, Brad Kling made a surprising discovery that propelled his interest in the paranormal. July 6, 1990, I was on a family vacation in Gettysburg. It was broad daylight and we're driving out of town. I look over in this field and I notice this group of, of Union soldiers just wandering through the field. I think they're doing a reenactment. So I tell my dad, hey, pull over. I want to get this on videotape. He does. I jump out, run about halfway across this field, stop, and I pan across. They're in frame for just a few seconds, and I stop it because I want to get a little bit closer. As soon as I look up to start running again, they're gone. And I mean, nowhere to be found. They would have had to move about 300 yards in a second to be out of my sight. There was no possible way. It was at that very moment that I knew that the paranormal existed. And I've been wanting answers ever since. I'm actually sleeping. talking about so I go back and I review the tape there was some type of apparition some type of silhouette there was a soldier standing like this right now we cut to the actual ghost footage from 1999 if you look to the right of the two tombstones you can clearly see a figure standing there dressed in white as we enhance the video you can now see in more detail this figure standing at attention. In the video, the apparition is actually probably about this high. Standing just like this. But as you can see, he would have to be up here if he was doing that, which is possible.